Welcome back, friends. We are going to make the cutest little journal page with our cut florals today. All right, I have some just super easy white acrylic paint and some Craft Smart from Michael's Red. I'm make this pinky shade. I'm just gonna spread it all over this little tiny journal page that I have. It's actually an autograph album that I found at an estate sale. I really like it. Next, I'm going to add, I think, some orange, because like I said, I'm into the summer colors right now. So I'm going to put a little bit of orange, a little bit of yellow, and now let's see, got my pink. I'm going to use some neon pink because this is super vibrant and then add a little white and boom there it is I know something happened with the video and it cut out but you can see I've got the orange shaded in there along with the pink so next I have this handmade stamp that I'm going to throw some red paint on and this is what it looks like after I've stamped it it's not real clear but I don't care I like the messy part of it this is another fun stamp I've made with some wood numbers and some balsa wood that I found at the 99 cent store and I sprayed it with some ink and stamped it on top of those circles and it kind of came out but I don't I kind of like it like that so I'm just going to keep going and add this little stamped bird cage. So I'm going to ink this up really well and just lay it flat here press it down really well i left the plastic cover on because it's such a long stamp it's hard to put on an acrylic block so i just like to leave it in its little packaging and now i'm going to add some fun scraps of paper i like this one because the hues kind of match with the pink and I'm just gonna lay this here and I'm gonna add the yellow right across. Next, I'm gonna add this little squiggle stamp. Oh, my goodness, I have had this stamp for years and years and years. I wish I could tell you where I got it, but I have no idea. Okay. So maybe I can find something similar to it and link it down below. But I'm going to just add that there, and that looks good. All right, here comes the fun part. These are the little flowers that I cut out that we made in my previous video. So you can go back, find out how to make these. They're so much fun, and they can be used so many ways it's not even funny but I like to play around with them to before I decide where to put it down and I'm just going to use this glue and tuck them all in here I'm going to stamp the word envision on here to finish this off and I think I am going to add just a little bit of white to offset that little white square right there I love this page it has so much color and movement and I hope so much that you have enjoyed it as well like and subscribe to my page comment tell me what you thought and I will see you back again next time